man, let's go see. There's a quest up here. I want to see what. They were over here. Surprise! Some, some kind of lamp. Yeah, it's a strange speaker. Let's hit it. Let us give thanks to fate, dear travelers. Your wanderings have finally brought you here. Surely you must be searching for a certain depth of this encounter beyond your wildest dream. An astonishing journey as beyond your mundane imagination. Now the opportunity to fulfill all your desires has been laid before you right here, right? Oh. Dive into a brand new Daya three day revere. Step on the ground stage and experience something beyond your wildest dreams. Swim freely in a pool and more exercise the fans and haunts in ancient, in ancient castles. Okay, let's take us to the world of reverie. All right, let's see what it is. Seems like a new attraction. Looks like some kind of new play. Are you interested? I'm definitely sounds cool, she says. Okay, five more months to go. All right, then let's say the paraphrase. Take us to the world of reverie. Take us to the world of reverie. <laughs> Ah, uh, perfect. Your, reg your registrations have been confirmed. I'll begin shortly. All right. Oh, so we got three choices: a town floating in the sky. See all the paintings. Wow. All right, so now we have three paintings, it looks like, and we need to... <laughs> I, I'm just going to follow with this. Oh, hold on. Gotta get this guy right here. Another ticket. Alright. Staff and equipment in position. Mechanisms are prepped and ready. This performance is a black other play from the three day reverie. Awesome. Experience adventure set foot to set foot. Okay. Ahoy there, land numbers. Get over here. A voice from speaker changed. Sounds like someone really is calling us. So, is this trying to interact with us? Who else are we talking to? You're the best out of this bunch of scallywags. We can't set sail without you. I'm the chief mate, the black naker. You'll be working with me on this voyage, Savvy. Work up towers is your first day on deck, and our quartermaster will make sure you get the best meat, cream, heart tech, and dandelion oil. Speaker continues to narrate the scene before you. Okay, sailors ground. All right. Oh, the speaker also provided detailed narration of the scene. Wow, we're just welcome to the black. Shall we play along? Anyway, thank you everyone. We haven't had the preserved meat or hard tack here yet, but it must be tasty. It's a pity we can't see the actors or props. Yeah, the attraction is called the Three Day Reverie. So are we just supposed to rely on our own powers of daydreaming? That would probably just save a lot on cost. On the real power ship actually being able to sell anywhere among us knows that must be expensive. But still, only having the narrator is too far. I guess we have to try. All right, I'm going to go to the chart. As the noise dies down, a powerful looking man appears on the bridge. 
He's just like a common sailor, sailor save for the ragged tricorn on his head. His left hand is missing, replaced by Rusty Hook, who's Captain Hook. Captain Wills arrived. The time is now, Hardys. Get to your position. Double our weapons, enter supplies, and prepare the ship. Get ready to weigh anchor. Whoa, the captain's here. He also sounds calm and reliable. The treasure isn't far now, lads. The final leg of the voyage, the most important. Our wounded comrades drowned supplies, lost dust spurs, and even cast a run with scant script and save for. The price we'll pay will not have been in pain. As long as we find a legendary treasure, we can appease a crack and afford a deadline. Never again must we seek dishonest merchants to plunder our pocket change. But give it your all, you scurvy dogs. Do it so our town may know peace and our friends and family no longer need to fear tyranny and toil. Full speed ahead. Treasure, treasure, full speed ahead for peace. And welcome the powerful new, report, new recruits aboard. Let Black Naker prepares to weigh anchor and set sail for the treasure. Or the speaker really sets the scene, make all these pirates really different from what Paimon imagined. Paimon's curious what happens next. Speaker said we can ride a choo choo cart. Oh, uh, this is gonna be cold. We continue to play. Anchors away, traveler. This is pretty cool, so we're going to ride in, pretend it's like a pirate ship. Go. Alright, we boarded the play. Oh no, we're getting attacked by lightning. As they thought to treasure the black naker rushed into dangerous waters. Thick fog filled the air, rolling waves of the hull relentlessly causing the ship to sink violently. Terrifying lightning struck frequently, barely missing the mast and the sail. The lookout the top of the mast could see nothing from the crow's nest. Even the compass failed, so perhaps they were hearing things, but the crew felt they could hear the cries. Urged the choo choo cart to shake it so much. It's really dizzy, like we're sailing the ship. Paimon gets dizzy. It is crucial the captain took over his duty as the helmsman, almost adapted to the rough waves. The black naked started to sail out. Don't panic, lads. Our intuition and blessings and will guide us as we find our way. Feels like we've gotten ourselves in danger again. Be vigilant. These are failed to get the treasure. Uh oh. Look what it is. Enemy attack. Attack sea monsters. Ah. All right, now we gotta defeat the minions. This is hard. You can use your keyboard, not your mouse. All right, two down. Oh, we did it. We got we got to treasure. That's everything. On to the next. I guess we get and then we get back in the ship. All right, go to the location to hit. All right, we gotta keep riding in choosing part. However, the beautiful enchanting singing traveled across the distance and then the battle dissipated. 
Captain, something doesn't seem right. I can't. I can see the food my grandma makes, and it smells good. You want to be with us with your siren song? That trick is too old, lads. Plug your ears with met with mushrooms. What mushrooms? We don't have any. Can we just use our hands? Watch out! We're heading off the cliff. Brace yourself for impact. Oh, guard me, Hardies! Grab us something so we don't get thrown overboard. Wait a minute! Why are the cliffs in the ocean? Please, we go down. The Another cliff. Maintain brace positions. Too close in a row. We should have been thrown off if we were on a real ship. Even sailors survive the impact. The boat would be smashed. Wow. Go to the location of the hidden treasure. Alright, looks like we gotta fight some hill trails. What's up, guys? I knew I was gonna have to. I will not quietly restore our health. We got ahead of her, man. Our chest. We um, put some food in me. There we go. A reward on the road. All right. So we're gonna go up here. Oh, we got another. Pictogram thing. There it is. Wow. Then we got something we're about to shoot too. Wow. Oh. All right, let's do it. We got to enter the preprint world. Do right, so I want a surprise? Another gang of pirates been waiting back here all this time. What's going on? Are we serious of being robbed by other pirates? Nonsense. We robbed only the plenty of rich unfolk. We can't keep struggling, retreading old paths. Alright, looks like I have lives down here. Am I just supposed to avoid these? Too easy to get hit. I miss me. Oh, I messed up there. I guess let's try to survive.
Ambushing it. Alright, Motley Crew. Alright, have more fire broadsides. So far, so good. Captain, well, let's leave this place. Okay, leaving the preprint world. We got a chest, so we survived. Is this an answer from this world? All right, meet the sailors. All right, we gotta go back here. Ooh. Oh, we got another pull here. Congratulations. With the strength of new sailors, Captain Will easily defeats his enemies, sending them running. Having overcome every challenge the voyage could throw at them, nothing can stop the crew of the Black Naker now. Such a loyal crew of the Black Naker, me lads. Even those literally covered, literally biscuit eaters ambushed us, none of you panicked. And of course, the newest crew members contributed mightily. They swept away all the opposition to make this flot them and jet them. Of course, bad pirates like that pine mine and travel like a fight tour. Getting into a pine mine? It's okay, the journey was pretty thrilling. And we've been through thick and thin with the Captain Will. The pine mine can be a bit serious. Based on our research, if we break through that stone well, we can find the treasure. Crucial moment shall give you the honor. I got an idea I got to discuss. Alright, just fire in the hall. Just ready to celebrate, lads. Go ahead and open it. Alright, operate. And we did it. Alright. Oh, we cleared the path. Now we gotta go to the location of the hidden treasure. We got another one of these. Oh, look at all the treasure. Yay, we found it. The legendary treasure. So much more a pine mine can swim in it. But why does this more seem different than the more we usually see? Don't tell pine mine. Hey, Ledger. It's a bunch of decorative fake coins. Faced with unexpected development, what will the crew do? Captain, we were hog sworn. Our intel be wrong, but legendary treasure could it be all fake. No wonder I had a bad feeling. The so called legendary tre treasure could be bait, luring us in a trap. And recall the very people that who braved hell and high water in search for the treasure, and the quality of weapon advanced to ships bring with them. The sailors exhausted on the journey can easily be captured and sold to labor. No, no, we were all tricked. How could this be a Chinese trap? From cost perspective, it makes sense. Uh-oh, you have a point. I almost forgot we're acting. Even though there aren't any other actors on the set, it's a bit shabby. Paimon can tell the work. A lot of work went into this. Paimon thinks we should respect that. Let's hear for our crewmates. Yay! Captain Will gathers in the sailors in front of the fake treasure. Captain, this... Is this... The doing of our enemies? No, this is beyond them. If we didn't make it, they'd be disappointed in our old food. Perhaps the, the ones behind us are on the way here. Given our current state, it would be wise to take them head on. Clean up the area and see if there's any chests we miss. And I'm with Joel. Oh, I always said hard work is rewarded. See the chest over there is for our new sailors. We've done so much. How are you going? 
But not only do we make money, we racked up a lot of losses. What are we going to do? Keep searching for dishonest profiteers and try to scrape together enough booty to satisfy the Kraken? I was about to point out that on this voyage, we of the Black Knacker found the treasure more precious than more. And we're not going back with nothing to show for it. We found the ways to cross the Roaring Sea, strategies to feed our enemies, and the courage to face any challenge. Think about it, Buckos. Even if we found the Ocho more, would it really buy peace in for our town? Sailor goes, that makes sense. We all know how greedy Kraken is, no matter the treasure we shut down for as for seconds. Oh, he's right. Even Rich Towns have gone dozens of times. Is never the best answer? You're right. Once up the pie we wouldn't let the monsters have its way. But the captain and screw were just ordinary people. So he must solve the problem as the source. That's why given it more and more, it doesn't make any sense. With the fighting experience we gained on this voyage, I'm sure we can defeat the Kraken and lift the shadow of cast over our town. Come on, me hearties. Do you trust your captain? Sounds risky, Captain, but worth a shot. So this is the only way we keep giving in. Eventually we will have nothing left. We'll have nowhere to run. The captain's right. It's worth risking our lives over. We can't take any longer. Then it's settled. From now on, I'll train everyone on the Black Necker for this all, for this all purpose. Especially now, the notes cremates are true swashbucklers. They're practically invincible. Captain Will by is no means a remnant rich male. Only if he lends us his strength, the cold crew with the black naked will do something the power to repay you. Will you voyage to the black naked, train with us, and punish that Kraken for it? Perfid? Perfidy? I don't know what that word means. Yeah, that spirit. Be brave. And fight the awful sea monster. Let's help our friends. My pleasure. Very amazing. You longer... You're no longer so novice sailors, you're old soul, core members of the Black Crew. You're my helpers and saviors of the rest of the crew and all the people in town. Now it's time for the Black Naker to return to port. Resting up, prepare the final battle against the beast. The speaker summarized the end of the first act. After triumphing, triumphing in Norris trials, you sailors the pillars of the crew led by Captain Will. The next part is called the Captain Naker Strikes Back. That's funny. As the narration ends, the motion side degree. Uh, just ends there. Pine was starting to get into. It's kind of nice to have an intermission. You have a point there. If that play was any longer, most guests would be tired and fight the sea monster. And the second use some work. Uh, Dice 3 day Reveille. Certain has potential. Final state cure so it just die a person is. Alright, we Wow, we have forty creamer gems. I'll keep this close. Oh, we got a poster too. Go through here and get some more stuff. Scatter! Bring forth! Let me weave you a verse. Rain outlines your fate. I let my guard down. No escape! <laughs> Incoming! Cut to the chase! <laughs> Alright, go we missing. There it is. Now we can get it. That's everything. More bastards we need. See, I don't know if I want to start this challenge. We gotta listen go listen to the announcement. Oh, it's probably part of the thing anyway. Yeah, figured that. You're right.
We got another chest. Which has what is it? You give, you receive. Alright. I guess this is the next.